So now, the second core concept is the subtraction property. And again, we could just tie this right in with the addition property, and just instead of subtracting, we're adding a negative to it, which is what I have, it, which is how I like to think of it. Instead of using subtraction, just think of it as that you're adding a negative number um, to each side. All right. And again, so if I'm adding a negative five to each side in this first example here, negative three plus negative five would be a negative eight. It's still less than or equal to a negative one fourth and so on. So again, if we just look at this core concept, and here's the first one. This is a positive 8. So to get rid of a positive 8, I'm going to add a negative 8 to each side. Again, I just like to think of it as adding a negative 8 instead of subtracting. It just makes it easier in my mind. So the 8 and the negative 8 go away, and I get y is less than or equal to. Here, the signs are different. So I subtract, and I take the sign of the larger number, and my sum will be exact. So I have y is less than or equal to a negative 3. And now I graph that, so I have negative 4, negative 3, negative 2. I'm going to have it closed at a negative 3, and then shaded to the left. This next one, again, I'm solving for m, so the m is on the right this time, so I'm going to subtract 1.4, add a negative 1 fourth to each side. And when I do that, and I have negative 8 and negative 1.4, I go ahead and I add, so that's a negative 9.4, because I add and keep, is less than m. Remember, I still want to rewrite it, so it's written as m, and then negative 9.4 on the right. And again, I don't want to upset the alligator. This time, the alligator is eating the m, so I want to make sure I rewrite it and have the alligator eating the m. So now I have a negative 9.4, so I'm going to have negative 10 and negative 9, and then the negative 10, negative 9, Negative 9.4 would be about right here. And again, it's greater than, so it's an open circle this time and shaded to the right.